Hi, I'm Niall from Gulfstream Boat Sales. This is a 2005 Aquafish 23 fitted with a Mercruiser, uh, 2.8 litre, 165 horsepower Bravo 3 stern drive diesel. So this one you can see is a Category C boat, an Aquafish 23. It's 23 foot long, has a beam of 8 foot 4 inches. The draft is 3 foot 6 with the leg lowered. The hull weight, I think that's excluding the engine, is 885 kilos. So probably around maybe 1400, 1500 kilos all up. Good, clean, honest boat has been used on the north coast of Ireland since October 2009, regularly serviced by Tony's Marine Services here in Coleraine, a very highly respected engineer, Mercruiser engineer, and um, yeah, everything on the boat works, and it is a nice example of one of these Aquafish 23s. So taking a walk down along the port side, it is in very good condition. Navy gel coat looks good down this side. Well, she's anti-foiled in red. The aft deck, huge big aft deck on this thing, perfect for fishing a lot of people. From the starboard side, if you stand back, it looks good. So taking a look then at the transom, we've got a little folding stainless steel bathing ladder over here. We've got deck scuppers with pretty new looking rubbers on them. Now the boat is fitted with a Mercruiser, 2.8 liter diesel, turbo diesel unit, makes 165 horsepower, and it's matched up to this Bravo 3 stern drive. Um, it's spinning 26 inch pitch propellers. There's a huge aft deck on this boat, um, and it's ideal. I mean, I, I sort of refer to it as a, like a half decker would be the traditional term, as far as I know. Obviously, all molded skid uh, surfaces, paint finish, and it's just hit it with a hose to, to keep it clean. Get a scrubbing brush there in the gunnel. Um, engine access is very easy, just pull that, that box forward. And uh, as I said, you got these nice high guard rails all the way around it as well. Rod holders, steering cleats, good condition on both sides. Three rod holders up the port side as well. And then up forward, you've got this little molded in step here. So you can hop up here, grab on the handrail, and then a huge chunky stainless steel handrail on the roof and access up onto the foredeck. So decent space on the foredeck, big Samson post for, for tying off your anchor. Twin screens up forward. You go. Everything looks pretty good up here. And again, you can walk down along this side deck as well and easily get access back into the aft deck. A twin battery system on the boat, as far as I'm aware. So it's got a four position isolator switch. So now we'll head into the wheelhouse. So you can lock this door, but just put a padlock on there. And then you've got access into the wheelhouse. Again, fairly basic, but it does everything it needs to do. So one step down in here, passenger seat, helm seat, V-berth arrangement up forward, uh, V-seat area, and then this boat is packed to the gunnels with electronics. I think I went through all this stuff. Somebody must have left this on. That's why I came on with the isolator switch, but I did go through all of this gear on the sea trail video. So if you want to know how this all works and confirm that it is all working, you can check out our separate sea trail video. But full standing headroom for me, I'm five foot ten, and there's another two or three inches of clearance. There's even more if you stand down here, because there's a wee step there. Um, so plenty, plenty of headroom in here. It's a good size wheelhouse. There's room for the helm seat, the passenger seat, and somebody else to stand here. There's room for four or five people to sit up in that wee V-berth area. So you just unclip the box and it slides forward to give you access to the engine. So excellent service access for you know daily checks or more in-depth maintenance the engine itself again looks clean and tidy it starts on the button um it runs well i can't remember the exact figures but it sort of cruises 16 17 18 knots check out the sea trail video and you'll see exactly how it performs but there's more than enough power here in this 2.8 liter unit to get this boat up on plane quickly and run it you know at, at sort of good solid cruising plane in speeds um it is what it is, Aquafish 23, properly serviced, properly looked after. Yeah. The trailer is included in the advertised asking price. If you like the look of this Aquafish 23 and you want to find out more about it, then please sign up for VIP access on our website at gulfstreamboatsales.com. All you have to do is pop your name and email address into the box below this video on our site at gulfstreamboatsales.com and you can get VIP access, which is completely free. Once you've signed up, then navigate back to the Aquafish 23 page and you can watch our full length video tour where I go through the boat a lot more detail, I'll give you a really good look around the engine bay, we'll look in all the storage compartments, look in the bilges, walk you through the wheelhouse and just show you all the features that are on this boat and show you the condition that it's in and hopefully help you to figure out whether it might be the right boat for you. So that's sign up for VIP access 
at gulfstreamboatsales.com. Thank you very much for taking the time to watch the video. I hope you find it useful.